Measuring length. One way to measure an object is to find its length. Length is how long an object is. There are two types of measurement for length, non-standard units of measurement and standard units of measurement. Non-standard units of measurement is using a group of items, such as paper clips, to find the length. Whatever group of items you choose to measure with will work, as long as they are all the same size. If you use paper clips, they must all be the same size. To measure with paper clips, we line up paper clips along the side of an object to see how many paper clips long it is. Here is one paper clip, and here is a toothbrush. Can you estimate or predict how many paper clips long the toothbrush is? Estimate means to make a guess. Can you guess how many paper clips long the toothbrush is? I would estimate that the toothbrush is about four paper clips long. To check our estimate, we need to measure the toothbrush with paper clips. Three important rules to remember when measuring with non-standard units of measurement are: one. Make sure all paper clips or other items are the same size. Two, make sure to line up the first paper clip or other object at the edge of the object. And three, make sure to place the paper clips right next to each other. We estimated that our toothbrush would be four paper clips long. Here we measured it out. And it looks like the actual length was five paper clips. We made a pretty close estimate. Here is one block, and here is a worm. Estimate how many blocks long the worm is. Did you estimate ten blocks? The worm is ten blocks long. When using non-standard units of measurement, we can use many different items to help us measure. We can put our hands side by side across our computer keyboard to see how many hands long it is. We can stack a row of building blocks to see how many building blocks long our dog's tail is. There are many other items: erasers, pieces of paper, and many more. The important thing to remember is that whatever group of items you use, they must all be the same size. Now let's talk about standard units of measurement. Standard units of measurement are set units of measurement. This means that they are always the same size. We will use a ruler to measure when using standard units of measurement. The placement of the object to the ruler is very important. We always place the object we are measuring at the end of the ruler. The edge of the object should be lined up with zero. Look at these examples. This is not the correct way to measure the block. Notice the placement of the block. The edge of the block is not lined up with the end of the ruler. Notice the measurement of the block is about four inches in this picture. Now look at this picture. This is the correct way to measure the block. The edge of the block is lined up with the end of the ruler. The true measurement of the block is about three inches. Inch. Your thumb is about an inch long. We use inches to measure the lengths of smaller objects. Objects such as birthday candles, toy cars or trucks, crayons, and pieces of paper are all things we can measure with inches. Let's measure our toothbrush with inches. Here is the toothbrush, and here is a ruler. The ruler shows us that the toothbrush is about six inches long. Can you estimate how many inches the worm is? I would estimate the worm is about seven inches long. Looking at the ruler, we can see that the worm is actually six inches long. Our estimate of seven was very close. A foot. There are twelve inches in one foot. A football is about a foot long. We use feet to measure large objects. People, chairs, bikes, couches, and tables are all objects that can be measured with feet. Here is a foot, and here is a picture frame.
Can you estimate how many feet long the frame is? I would estimate the frame is about 3 feet long. When measuring with a ruler, we need to place the ruler at the edge of the object, and then we need to mark the place where the ruler ends. Then we place the end of the ruler at the mark that we made. We estimated that the picture frame would be about 3 feet, but the actual length is 2 feet long. Can you estimate how long this television is? Did you estimate 3 feet long? This television is about 3 feet long.